SCH families, I'm Ms. Bloy. I'm the Girls Lower School Librarian. Uh, Mrs. Trulier and I wanted to share a quick video to just show you how to use our online catalog. Um, if you're watching this, it's probably because you're interested in taking out some books for your child while we're all social distancing and we can't be at school. That's wonderful, um, but we do need to know what books to pull for you. So this is going to help us um, figure that out. Now, you're also going to receive a link for a book request form, a Google form that you'll fill out and you'll tell us what books you're looking for but we want to make sure that we're going to get things that are currently available. So let's go through the catalog. When you click on a link for our catalog, it's always going to take you to this select a site page. And um, that's because SEH is so lucky. We have three libraries, so we have to find the right one. Um, so Mrs. Trulier and I work in the Dixon Lower School Library, and that's where we're going to be able to pull books from. So let's click there to get started. It's going to take you to this landing page. There are a couple different search options here. You're welcome to play around with them, um, but we're just gonna go over how to use the main search feature. So we'll click on the magnifying glass and it's gonna take you to our search page. Now, um, this smart search feature, it's pretty easy to use. If you search for any word, it's gonna look through our catalog and all the records for that word. So um, it's good if you're looking for an author, if you're looking for a title, if you're looking for a subject. Let's do a subject search first. So I'm going to look for books. My child wants some books. She wants to learn more about tigers. So I'm going to search for tigers. And you can see um, I've got 50 results. And actually over here on the right on this arrow, I can click find more. And there's actually 78 books that we that, that have tiger somewhere in the record. So um, I want to point out, though, that these first two books on tigers are checked out. And we know that because there's a red banner right up at the top of the cover and it says out. So we can't pull those for you. Somebody already has those at home and is enjoying them. So this next book in our list though, it's called Tigers. It looks like it's a nonfiction book from the call number, but we can click on this drop down menu to look at more details. And here it's describing the book, discusses the life of tigers and profiles different types of tigers. So if that's the book that you would like, um, you can check here where it says copies, and it's telling us that it's in the lower school library. And here's the important part, it says status available. So we know we should have this one on our shelf somewhere. So go back to details, you'll note the title and the author, and you're gonna go to your request form and you're going to write Tigers by Sally Morgan. And that's pretty much enough information for us to find that book for you. So that's the first book. Now, if you have a specific title in mind, um, you can search by that too. Um, if I type in Katie Wu, it's a pretty popular series. Um, we have 18 results that come back. So uh, Katie Wu, we have a lot of them, but there is a couple things to note about this as well. Um, this, these two, they say capstone at the top of the cover. That actually means that they are an ebook. So you can read that online, we don't have that physical copy in the library, but it is available to read online. Um, but let's see, so if we decide we would like Earth Day is coming up, we'll do Katie Saves the Earth, and that's by Fran Mnuchin. We're just gonna do the same thing, just do, look at that little drop down menu with Earth Day coming up. Katie decides to have a yard sale with her friends and recycle her old toys. You can click on copies and look at the status. It says it's available, so it should be on the shelf. So on our, we're going to go back to our Google form and just type Katie saves the day and it's by Fran Mnuchin. Hopefully I spelled that right. Um, then I just want to show you one more um, way to search and that's by the author. Um, so if I just type Rowling and hit enter, I have um, some biographies about J.K. Rowling. You can see this one's already checked out. And then I get some of her books that she's written. So I've got books about her and I've got books by her. Um, so if we choose, if you're just getting to that last Harry Potter book and you're ready to read it, go ahead and check the drop down menu because we have a copy available. And so back to your form, you'll type in Harry Potter and The Deathly Hallows by J. 
JK Rowling. Um, so you've got three books on your list. Um, I think that we decided probably you can choose up to five. And um, if you would like, one of the things that's on the form is, would you like a substitution if your request is unavailable? So if it turns out that the book that you would like is not there, um, if you say yes, um, Mrs. Truly or myself will choose something similar. Um, we know your kids pretty well, so hopefully you'll be able to find something that they like and um, that way you'll still get something though it might not be exactly what you wanted. If you're sure what you want and you don't want us to make any, um, any choices for you, then just go ahead and click no. All right, so that is how you'll search our catalog and find out if the books that you're looking for are available. If you have any questions, you can contact myself or Mrs. Trulier. We're both happy to help um, any of our lower school families. So please do get in touch and good luck. We hope um, to hear from you. Thanks.